Right, it's the first sunny day, proper sunny day for quite a few weeks really, this is. No wind, no rain, no clouds. I've come to Cheddar, I want to do uh, a really good walk, it's the uh, restrictions and lockdown for a month starting tomorrow. It's the presidential election and no one knows the result yet, it's sort of head and head between Biden and and um, Trump at the moment. That's world events. But I'm coming out because I've been, we've all been stuck in and we're going to be stuck in even more soon because of the lockdown. But you are allowed to exercise. Right, anyway, I've just come round the corner after the, the tower's locked, it's probably too slippery. And there we've got a lovely picture of Glastonbury Tor. I can hear people coming already. Look at that. It's beautiful, isn't it? I've taken some pictures. So, I've got to get a move on. I can hear people. What well, I don't really want to be stuck with a group of 30 people or anything, which I wouldn't have thought was allowed, but it might be because it's the last day before the lockdown. Everyone's getting out. Um, so that's the state of the world. 2020, this is November, I think it's the third today, is it? It's either the third or the fourth today. No, it's the fourth today. It's the fourth of November, 2020. And I'm walking up the south side of Cheddar Gorge, round the back way I came, and uh, they probably don't allow the tower because the distance in, there's somebody coming close, noisily, I can hear noisy people coming, there's already someone ahead of me. But the reason I've come out today to Cheddar in particular is because I'm probably going to severely cut my public transport that I do because of the Covid. It's so risky on a bus in normal conditions. There's somebody up there on the wall. I'm just going to go over here a minute. While they're on that. Yeah. Um, so I thought I'd do cheddar because there's a lot of walks I can do. And if it's, if it's a day like this, I can even cycle. Without the need for public transport, if I can help it. it depends how bad it's only got to go a month. But you see, if they lock the buses up more, more restrictions, then um, they might carry on to after Christmas. So I thought, well, get out today, ain't too hot, ain't too cold. I've got my picnic, and um, yeah, I can see people, people with very luminous jackets on looking very talkative. So basically I'm going around the, the south side, then I'm going to again head for Black Rock and then after Black Rock, oh they're stopping, these people stop all the time, after Black Rock I'm going to uh, go up hopefully, depending on obstacles on my way, I'm going to go to uh, Velvet Bomb. I've got people behind me and people in front of me at the moment. Right, then over and out. I'm climbing up. I've done it this way round because I find it's dangerous on the way down. I slipped several times on my last journey when it was damp on the way down. So today, I'm going up. When I do Velvet Bottom, the idea then is to perhaps go through Longwood 
and um, back through Piney Sites Farm in that way. I doubt if I'll go right across the top, although I had thought about doing um, the trig point. So we'll see. I've got to see what what I feel like. I brought a little radio with me actually because I just want to now and again see how the election's going on in America. Also, my mobile is very low in battery, so radio might allow me to see the time. We just have another zoom in before I turn off to Glastonbury. Yet. Glastonbury in the mist. Couldn't miss this today. That is good. That is good. Right, over and out everyone. Right, another small video. I've done all this in the past, don't forget, but of course I've never done it in 2020, November the 4th before. The day of the presidential election results. The main ones, anyway. The day, the eve before the lockdown due to COVID-19. Um... So a lot of people are getting out today. Although you are allowed to travel. If you've got a car, you're allowed to travel. <sighs> but some of us have to run on the buses and people don't do what they're told. They don't wear their masks properly on the bus. It's <sighs> a little bit of... Um, the gorge from here. Got to be careful, it's very slippery today. Oh, look at that. A little bit of an indentation where the water's run off. That would be a nice place for a bird to drink. Goat sat on the gorge top there, look. A lot of billy goats today, I've noticed. Resting in the sunshine. That's on the north side of the gorge. The little family brown goats. That could be the girls sat there. Look, they do keep them separate. They do stay apart actually most of the time. There's a big ram there though. With his, could be more rams, younger ones. They're a bit like the deer. They sort of segregate the sexes. A load more down there. Nyland Mound over there, which I refer to sometimes. Brent Knoll, Crooks Peak. I'm not going right down today. This will do. Oh, look at her right on the edge. <coughs> right. Oh my god, look at her. Get her on. For the video. 
I wouldn't do that. <laughs> Make video three, another small video. Lots of male goats there, lots of female goats and a mixture down there. Um, or sunbathing, enjoying a, the lovely sunshine. If you imagine what it was like here when we had the storms over the last couple of days. Um, how horrendous that would have been up here. <laughs> Oh, it would be nice, in a way, if you had the right camera, you could video a storm up here. You know, or at night. I'm sure people have done it. There will be people who have done that, but I haven't. I'm not worried, I haven't. This is nice in the daytime, we like this. And, of course, I was here about beginning of September over that side, concerned about the leaves on the trees depleting so early and I think they did it's only early it's only the 4th of November most of the trees are bare now the colour that you often get the different ambers and greens and colours and yellows is already gone I think it was early um, autumn this year I think it was because I come over here a lot this time of year to get on purpose to capture the colour and I mean basically it's um, very very wintry looking already it's not even winter it's only um, it's been autumn less than a month you know about two weeks it's been autumn and the, already we're getting these huge changes the weather is very disturbed or the the earth is the ice sheets are melting I think it's creating problems with the climate apparently people that live in Greenland and that's saying they can't believe it and these are young people that in a decade they've seen the ice sheet recede massively whereas before it would say 60 years to recede a bit now it's just ploughing um, big time anyway I'll put Cheddar Gorge videoed it loads of times of course down there you can see the the cars going up the gorge uh, my son's been in I don't think he doesn't know but he was involved in the boy racer thing coming down through the gorge where they would all meet with their boy racing cars I'm climbing up a bit at a time. I won't be doing that side yet. The plan is to go to Velvet Bottom and then over to those aerials over there and along the top then back through Longwood. That's plan A. But I always take my time doing this bit. Look how massive that bit is there. I always take my time to get the views. There's always a few changes. Just videoing a bit of it. There's a few people about.